Lisa, and we're the Empty Nest Projects. And this is Teddy. We sold our house and put our stuff in storage, and now we're on the road having some new adventures. Subscribe to follow along. So what are you doing though? I'm trying to rig something up to where I can pull on it from underneath rather than have to take the fan off each time. And then that way you can override the whatever the gear shifting thing is. Yeah. shifts. Mm -hmm. What's it in now? Neutral. Or just you put your fingers here while I climb up. Okay. Okay, so we got that little zip tie there. So next time we'll have to give that a try. As you can see, we've continued to have a problem with the gear shifter, so we came up with a YouTube fix workaround. We went on YouTube and looked at how do we deal with this, so we now have the zip tie on the thing that you have to pull out and then shift gears. Um, it's like a manual override. It's like a manual override. But. Just so everyone knows, full disclosure, we know that it's temporary and we need to go see a mechanic. Safety is important. So we're in Leavenworth, not the prison, but Leavenworth, Washington, which apparently is like a little Bavarian mountain, mountain re resort area. <clears throat> and we're lucky because it's the end of summer and everybody's back to school, so it's not that crowded. There's not that many people. Mm -mm. Our neighbors are watching a football game, so they're having a lot of fun. But we made some yummy soup. I guess a little... Bavarian influence? No. no. Polish <laughs> kielbasa, whatever. They'll come in. But tomorrow, or one of these days, we'll definitely, he's underneath the table, I saw him. We're one of these days, we're gonna, gonna have to go get some German food. I saw a restaurant that serves Jaeger schnitzel, like mm -hmm. I remember from being in the Bill's army. I always excited to have Jaeger schnitzel, so. And I work. Geoch Loft, by the way. Oh, Probably bummer. Here. I saw that. I thought I thought they were up by like 14 points for a while. They were. I thought it was, they was in the bag. We thought it was in the bag too. Oh. Well. 
like, you did, you're gonna die. You're gonna die. <laughs> so and we were not in shape. <laughs> and you died. And because the first 15 seemed like, this is pretty simple. You get there, you sit down, have a beer, okay, yeah, let's go 15 more. Oh yeah, you're gonna die. But you're starting going up the Pyrenees, right? Right. Yes. So, what, so this is the thing, um, if you know you're gonna do this, there's a hostel, and I can't remember the name, um, make a reservation. Oh. A year ahead um, and stay there. I mean, it's booked well beyond. But we were unprepared. We were like out of six, Southeast Asia. We got walking sticks and we're like, okay, we're going to do this. And our last name is Santiago as well. Oh. <laughs> oh. So, um, we had these steps. Oh, this is the first day. Yeah. Now, she was in better shape than me, but I am literally throwing literally. Out the steps. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get to the monastery, okay. and these monks will choose to grab some pills on his way. We're kind of getting used to being spontaneous uh, with this Good. band because it doesn't matter where you stay, does it? <laughs> well, we've had to change. Like, so we went on the first trip. We left. We left from Bellingham and we went to like oh, San Jose because our daughter was moving into her apartment and we were helping her move. Right. And then we had all these plans to go up through Tahoe and stuff. And then everything was on fire, so we we're right. like, no, let's stick to the. Coast. So we had to change plans. Like every single plan we had, we changed. Yeah. Yeah. We put we put all our stuff in storage and we're spending at least three months in a van and then we're yeah, gonna yeah. get another place for do, do a short term rental. For the winter. And then in the summer. Yeah, Camino. And you're both nurses, I understand. Mm -hmm. Are you doing traveling nursing or are you Well I work remote and he's per diem and Per diem, I'm per diem, I'm hospital per diem. Yeah, so he only has to be back four days a month. So we figured he'd do the four days at the beginning of May. with some nurses about walking the Camino. Does it make you more excited to walk the Camino? Yeah, totally. Yeah, I'm ready for it. They were cute. She was really sweet. Yeah. She was telling me how she was a hospice nurse. She was telling me that her husband is 13 years older than her. Thir oh, okay. And she was like, I'm on his timeline. Mm -hmm. So she was saying she's on his timeline. Uh -huh. When he retired, she stopped working so much because she wanted to be on his timeline. Oh. You know what I do see in here, Will? Cookies. And perfect weather for some hot tea. Uh, just take a cookie, please. Sometimes.
Sometimes we stay places where trains are going by. But we slept fine, so that's good. Today is a work day, so I am signing into work. But today is All right, here we go. Leavenworth, Washington, where they want everything to look just like Bavaria. You know what was the most interesting thing about, one of the most interesting things about when we were in Nuremberg? What? Is you remember we went to the top of that tower? No, what, what did we go? It was a tower, wasn't it? Of, the, of that castle, castle there? Yeah. It was like the tower of the castle? Sure. And they had the pictures of what it looked like before. Not yet. Yeah, and so you were in Nuremberg and it's beautiful and everything is like, oh, everything is like, Oh, like that, right? Like, oh, cute, cute Bavarian architecture. Lovely. And then really, when we did this thing, this tour, we went to the top of the tower, they showed a picture of what it looked like after it was all bombed in World War II by allies. And almost all of that is new. Yeah. They had to rebuild it because it was destroyed. They made it look like... And but they rebuilt it to look like it did before. So I don't know. It was just interesting that you're like, oh, it's so cute and authentic and historic, but really it's not, it's new. <laughs> mm, gelato and espresso. This, actually this place makes me really want to go to Europe. <laughs> How about you? Yeah, I think so, I want to go here too. Is this, do we go in over there? Yeah, I think so. Mo you want to go here? We're here. Move here, no. For a season. day. No. Happy Monday. Yes. Kitsch, Bavarian town. Happy Monday. <laughs> it's a work day, but we're keeping off. 